Hey everybody, welcome back. James Rule XRP here. And if you haven't yet, follow me on Twitter at Rule XRP because I research XRP daily, Ripple and XRP. And I also research the other top cryptos or digital assets that I'm invested in. Today I'm going to cover an article on VeChain. Now, the digital assets that I invest in are only assets or cryptocurrencies that have use cases. I've been doing extensive research on these cryptocurrencies for a pretty good while now. And every day I research and just see how the technology and where we are going with these different cryptocurrencies. VeChain is a small part of my investment, but I'm in, invested in it. Now, VeChain is a blockchain platform designed to enhance supply chain management and business processes. Its goal is to streamline these processes and information flow for complex supply chains through the use of distributed ledger technology, or DLT. The VeChain platform has two tokens, VeChain token, or VET, and VeChain Thor Energy, or VETHO. The former is used to transfer value across VeChain's network, and the latter is used as energy or gas to power transactions. Now, I purchased my VET or the VeChain token through BitTrue. And when you hold VeChain on any of the exchanges, you are going to stake Vito or the VeChain Thor Energy. Now on BitTrue, they give you the stake every 30 days. So if you're holding uh, whatever amount of Vito or I'm sorry, VeChain uh, in a 30 day, every 30 days they will pay you the Vito or VeChain Thor Energy off of that. This article was released today, June 26, 2020, at dailypriceaction.com, and the article is written by Justin Bennett. Vet USD, VeChain offers a symmetry rarely seen in the investment world. I'm going to read it word for word. The currency market is slow. There's no other way to say it. I mentioned before that June was likely to be a transitional month where new narratives would begin to take shape. But instead of just sitting around, I've been doing my research to find the next big multi-year plays. You may, you may have seen my previous post on Bitcoin and Ethereum. Those are two longer-term holds that I still believe in as the technicals are backed by strong fundamentals, especially now with central banks in full-on print mode. But today I want to talk about another cryptocurrency called VeChain. Ticker is VET or VETUSD. VeChain is a blockchain-based platform for the supply chain industry that allows companies and customers to track and verify the authenticity of products. Think of it as a platform that records and displays the truth about a supply chain. At least that's how the project started in 2015. VeChain has since entered the healthcare market, food safety, in the energy market, just to name a few. And kind of getting off of this article, VeChain has teamed up with Walmart in China and they are able to trace merchandise from the beginning of production to the final customer. This also applies to different companies. Uh, there is a meat manufacturing plant that they have teamed up with that can track each item and track the temperature from the data production or manufacturing to the end user. The management team is Sunny Liu is a co-founder, CEO, Jay Zhang, co-founder, CFO. Then you have partner COO, Kevin Fing, and I don't know how to pronounce this guy's name, the Partner Chief Technology Officer. And I'm just kind of kind of scrolled through these. This is the VeChain team.
Okay. The management team is made up of industry leaders that are backed by a plethora of skilled developers, which is what you want to see in a cryptocurrency. Their partners include Price Waterhouse Coopers, PwC, DNVGL, BMW, Walmart China, BYD, and many more. And I'm going to kind of zoom in on this image. V chains in the center. You can see the customers around. And if we go to the top, they're in agriculture, fisheries, telecom, carbon asset automotive, which includes BMW, tech partners, which includes Amazon Web Services, AWS, and many more, research, bulk commodity, transportation insurance, smart city, FMCG, which includes Walmart, fashion, financial, documents and copyright authentication, and logistics, which you know you know what DHL is. Okay, the image above is only a partial listing of VeChain's partners. At just 500 million, VeChain has a much smaller market cap than other cryptos like Bitcoin and Ethereum. That's why I see the opportunity though. The VeChain management team is in first class in my opinion and their product is not only in demand but it's actually in use today. And like I stated before, I only invest in digital assets which have use cases, whether it be for transferring money like XRP or VET, which is used to track merchandise and items. And also there is Casino Coin, which is used and which is going to be used in the gambling industry. And we'll get on that subject at another time. I have made a video on Casino Coin CSC. But only a tiny percentage of cryptocurrencies can say the same. You can even see these transactions in real time by using the VeChain universe. And this is showing VeChain VET transactions in real time. It's like a firework display. Let me refresh. And there's also another one here, cvchain.com. But anyway, let's get back. As for technicals, that USD looks prime for a breakout. The market has been consolidating below a penny for the last 19 months, but it's starting to look constructive. A monthly close above 0 .0085 or 8 tenths of a penny would confirm the breakout. In my opinion, it's going to take a monthly close above 0 .0085 or so to confirm the break. A breakout over the next few months agrees with my view that the cryptocurrency market is on the verge of another bull market. Like other cryptocurrencies I've discussed recently, I'm not trading VeChain. It's going to be a two-year hold for me at a minimum. I'm also more interested in the VeChain fundamental story, so I'm less concerned with the technicals. Disclaimer, I hold a position in VeChain, VetUSD. This information in this post is not financial advice. So as I stated before, I do extensive research on digital assets, cryptocurrency, mainly Ripple and XRP, but I am doing more extensive research on some of the other investments that I'm invested in. So if you like this video, please like and subscribe. I will be posting more here soon. And I hope that you all have a great day. We'll talk to you soon. Take care.